In this tutorial, we're going to be discussing about elements. What is an element? How does it work? In this tutorial, we're going to be discussing about elements. What is an element? How does it work? An element is the heart of a geyser. An element heats the water up. So we have two types of elements that are common. It's known as the boss element and the spiral quickcard element. This we can see are two orange elements. The orange represents three kilowatts. I'm going to run down quickly what elements you need to use on a 100 litre geyser, a 150 and a 200. So for the 100 litre geyser, you would use a two kilowatt element. That means 2000 watts. In other words, this element will have one spiral less and this will be red instead of orange. I don't have a two kilowatt on hand right now, but all that you'll remember is a 100 litre geyser will use a red color element, which is two kilowatt. Then a 150 litre geyser, common geyser, will use these two elements. Obviously, depending on the geyser, if it's a quick cut geyser, they'll be using the spiral element. If it's one of your older geysers, they'll be using a boss element. So a 150 uses three kilo element, which represents 3000 watts. Then moving on, we have a four kilowatt element, which will be blue in color, as well as blue in color. This is four kilowatts, represents 4000 watts. So the bigger the geyser are, the bigger the geyser is, the more wattage you need to heat the geyser up. So if you have a four kilowatt element, it represents 4000 watts. 3 kilowatt element represents 3000 watts. 2, 000, uh, 2 kilowatt element represents 2000 watts. That's all about elements. I'll be discussing later on in the tutorial on how to install the elements and how to wire them. 